Hello everyone, Golcon here and welcome to another episode of Foundation in the Coastal Map. We're right here where we left it and make sure you check the description, click on the 100 subscribers giveaway video for a chance to win a game of your liking. Right now we're sitting at 90, we are only 10 subscribers away for this uh, giveaway. So make sure you follow the rules there for a chance to win a, a, a game of your liking. Anyways, we're right here where we left it. Let's go ahead and unpause the game. Let's go ahead and start the game right away. One thing that I read one of your comments and I appreciate it is like um, to upgrade the military to the next tier, we have to, first of all, uh, you know, uh, fulfill their needs. Once we, I mean, all their needs are fulfilled, we can actually promote them uh, every month. Like you will promote a single uh, citizen or single uh, person like promote from surf to commoner that menu that pop up will give you the option to promote army once their needs are fulfilled anyways we are building a weaver's hut here to take care of our wool cloth situation right now we have quite a few wool as you can see here but not enough uh, cloth to produce clothes so we just need to wait bread is looking good flour uh wheat is go looking good flour is looking good i think this rate I mean, we could, as I said in the last episode, we might want to actually add an extra windmill, something like here, but we'll see. It's nothing that we have to rush right now. Weaver Hut is completed, and actually, I'm waiting for this one to get finished, built, and of course, we cannot forget our church that will soon be built. I mean, it's going to take some time. It takes a lot of uh, tools, but it'll get built eventually same with our garden here uh let's see yeah it's just tools planks i mean just waiting for builder i guess our builders are very busy uh we have like 12 building builders we counted so we have two here uh three three and then four four times three that's 12 builders this one we might remove in the future but not right now i think they're doing an excellent job right there in the middle we started really good with roads here, <laughs> but then it gets to a point where where you cannot control any anymore, anymore. Like you know, they're gonna walk. They, I mean, everywhere. So we cannot. I don't want to micromanage everything. Otherwise, it's gonna become a little bit boring because we're gonna be taking care of everything. So let them do whatever they want for now. Uh, I I'm seriously thinking of adding a a gathers hut here just for the berries to, you know, to at least increment or raise the chance of, you know, or actually the berry storage. Maybe we can sell some here. We can store, uh, put another granary, some like here. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. We just have to play, you know, by by what it, whatever happens in the game. So it looks like our, yeah. So I think we are, we have cut enough right now to, we can actually leave that one on cut. Uh, well, actually, we can cut this one, uh, but we have already cut enough here to increase this right here. So we want to remove this field, right? And then go this way instead. So we want to go this way right here. Oops, sorry. Okay, so that belongs to the other one, huh? Okay, I was like, why is it not getting removed? Oh, oh I'm sorry. <laughs> I should have not done that, but it looks like I did anyways. <laughs> all right this one right there and then this one all the way over here something like that right increase the size a little bit and then right here you can actually this where is it like in the middle i think i did it when i created this one did it not or something like that i think something like this will be good i don't know if it's gonna they're gonna be able to do it all if they do, good. If they don't, that's okay. And remove this one right here. And I think that's enough, right? I mean, we can expand it even more if we want to. I'm gonna lie, we can actually expand it here just in case they're able to. But for now, I think that's good. That's that's more than plenty, right? Yep, right here. And then let's go ahead and remove this one just to make it clean. And what else? I mean, we can actually tell them to. Let's see. We can actually tell them to, to do a little bit here if they want. All right. 
All right, perfect. Let's see what else we have to take care of. Uh, cheese is being produced. I mean, it's not... Oh, I, I paused the game accidentally there. Uh, beer. I mean, beer is, you know, constantly being produced. We're fine with that. How, how much beer we have? Wow, yeah, 213 beer. I don't think they're going to be producing any more. Yeah, that's what I thought. That is completely halted. I mean, we can actually stop this builder, the production, if we want to. But, you know, let it, let them produce... And what we can do is we can remove two people from here and uh, reassign them somewhere else. That also, you know, is, makes a lot of sense, right? So, yeah, one thing we have to consider is the building is building the uh, charcoal boner here and the tools production. So let's go ahead and do that. I think we did not have enough money, but I think we do now. So it's going to be the iron smelter. Right here, we were debating where to put it, right? I'm just going to place it, like, right here. I think right there next to the gold smelter. That will make... That, I mean, that, that that will make a lot of sense, right? Gold smelter, iron smelter next to each other. We're really needing to finish this one right here. I mean, we can pause the production or the building of these. And the, this is not taking tools, is it? And it probably is. Yes, it is. 16 tools oh where 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 where, where, where is there polished on where are stones oh, okay so probably yeah everything's going to be being delivered here is that what it is let's see what is he using uh well he's actually using tools marble and gold where are all our polished stones oh yep i found it <laughs> all right we can produce more stones if we want to I mean, I just don't want to add and add and add. I mean, we can even add this one right here. You know what I mean? But it's just going to be a more and more and more additions. And uh, the uh, we are not producing any any coins right now. We're all constantly losing coins. So that's something we need to consider, right? Military mission available. I'm not going to send anyone to the to the war yet. We can actually add a, a tenth uh, soldier, but not right now. I'm just going to wait, as I said in last episode, I'm going to wait for the, all of them to be fully trained or partially trained or at least not wounded to send them all into one battle. Right, into one mission so we can do as many missions as possible. Because right now we keep doing one, two, one, two. We haven't progressed. We haven't gone further for better rewards as well. Because it, it's, it gives a lot of rewards if you go further into the military missions. The rewards are very, very rewarding. All right, so yeah, I mean, all, all we need here for the automated uh, fatten is three more bundles, which is a lot. It's a lot. Three bundles is a lot, as you could see here. As you saw here, it takes 40 marble and 15 tools per bundle. Of course, and the five gold bars that we haven't stopped producing yet. All right, let's see what else we have to consider here. They're cutting the trees there. They're cutting the trees here as well, as you can see. I already cut a lot of them, actually. All right, we can inc I mean, uh, increase speed here. Yeah, the money situation. I keep seeing the gold coins here, and it's it's just not improving, not at all. And I believe it's going to be for, for the upkeep that is actually, you know, killing us right now. I mean, the income, we're selling some things, the you know, missions, trade, we're selling planks, that's where, you know, and source, polished stones, we sold zero. We have to think of, start producing more stones in the future here. But, but yeah, jewelry is zero. Yeah, and polished stones. Yeah, everything is either the market or the trade. I wish the trade were better, but as I said in the last episode, we need bread. But, you know, look at this. Bread is constantly on the decrease. It's just, it's a snowball. You know what I mean? And we have how many bakeries we have? We have one and two. Do we need a third one? That's the question. I mean, if we add another bakery, I mean, it could be good, but then it is. You know, right now we have, uh, well, actually, another bakery might not be a bad idea. We have 38. I just want them to keep producing and never stop. So. They take two per, right? One and one. Now, is who who takes the bread? Is the baker coming down here, take the flour, sorry, and then bring him back? Let's see. I think that's the baker. 
Uh, right there. Uh, no, that's the Miller. Okay. All right. So, yeah, I wonder if the Baker is the one that actually comes down here and grabs it. Or is the transporter who grabs it and bring it to him? I, I wonder how how that works. Because if, if it's the baker who has to come down here and grab it, uh, we we actually need another bakery. In my opinion, right? That's just my humble opinion here. I, if, if that's the case, I would actually add another bakery. That way they don't... You know, just by walking here, they, they're wasting a little bit of time. This one is doesn't have to walk. Oh, well, he actually does have to walk down here. Yep. All right. Anyways, uh, let's talk in and more concentration here. My monk is requesting an audience. Let's see what they want. They want 50 planks. I'm going to deliver. I'm going to deliver to the people. Although it's not going to give us any kind of uh, uh, reward that coins. It's just some influence. But that's okay. All right, what else What else do we want to look into here? Yeah, all we need to do is play in the wait game right now. Wait for tools, wait for... We can actually pause some of the constructions, right? To to make this one uh, build, get built faster. We can pause the... Ah, yeah, let's go ahead and pause this one right here. The automated fan mastery. We don't, we don't want that one right now. I mean, we want to see it, but we don't really need it. That's right now. That's going to be good for for citizens, I believe. So it can increase the area around the... I mean, the desirability around that area. Yeah, so let's go ahead and add that uh, gatherers hut. I think that we're going to really need it to start at least selling berries or something. You know what I mean? So people start consuming other food and not uh, bread all the time because... Though those that are consuming bread are only consuming bread and cheese and berries too. I mean, it's just everywhere around. Let's see. The marker will tell us. Yeah, 27 uh, berries. I think that's what's actually people eating the most now that I look at it. Because, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It's The food situation is just never, it's not improving. We can actually add five, ten more wheat farms, you know, but would that make any sense? It probably won't make any sense. In my opinion, it won't make any sense to add more wheat farms. We have two, four, five. And I think that's more than enough. Uh, we have 167 people. I mean, but we could add, as I said, we could add another bakery. And I think that's what I'm going to do. You know, we're building a lot of stuff. Builders are very busy right now. So let's make them even busier. <laughs> All right. If we want to, if we add another bakery... We can actually add a bakery like here, right in the middle of the city. And that's actually not a bad idea. Uh, it doesn't affect uh, desirability. And uh, I think I'm going to do it, actually. Uh, let's see. Unless I find a better position for it. We can actually build it behind the church. I think I'm going to do that. Yeah. Uh, well, they have to walk. Hmm. Or maybe we can just, we just place it right next to it. That's also, that's also an, uh, an idea there. We can actually place it here. So they grab water from here and the... Yeah, I'm going to do it there. I'm going to place it right there. No hard feelings. I'm just going to place it right there. Of course, we need 200 coins. Of course we do. <laughs> we have promotions available. So if we scroll all the way down, uh, according to one of your comments, we should see like the army at the end. Uh, uh, I mean, not right now. But we just need to wait for, to fulfill their needs, right? We are not promoting, so let's go ahead and enough promotion for now. We are not uh, doing military mission. And this we can do. Let's go ahead and build the bakery before I forget. And then this we can do the labor again. All right, everything is uh, looking nice. Uh, except for the food. But the people are quite, uh, you know, quote unquote happy. What they're complaining about. Mostly food, I bet. Yep. Food, food, food shortage, food shortage. Yeah, they're complaining about the food. It's not like a big deal, but they are, you know, they keep, they've been complaining about the food for what? It's like the fifth or the sixth episode where, they're, where the, our food situation hasn't been the greatest. So yeah, but it's okay. We actually build the gathers hut here. We can authorize and assign three people there. And you guys are not going to be walking. That is, that is a fact. You guys are not going to be walking through here, not whatsoever. Better walk 
through here and then through here. No, no, no business here, right? <laughs> I just want them. I mean, why? What, what are the needs, right? All right. So fish. We know the situation about the fish. We have said it many, many times in the past previous episodes. I think that's that. It is what it is for the fish. Let's see what else. Boar. I mean, we can actually add a. We get how many people it takes? Only one. We can actually add another hunter's hut, and that, that that's actually not a bad idea. It's not a terrible idea. Of course, the hunters, the boars, doesn't serve much to the people. Uh, it, it, I mean, it doesn't provide a lot. It's just a very slow building, for what I can tell. But of course, it provides something for the people to buy if there is not uh, bread or cheese. They're going for the cheese too. Remember when we had uh, 200 cheese and we were like, oh yeah, we don't know what we're going to do with all the cheese. Yeah, <laughs> we could use those right now, right? <laughs> but it happens. All right, in the meantime, while we wait, I would like to talk about the uh, future of the series and the and the, and the the channel, of course. We're going to be covering all the uh, city builders here pretty soon. Hopefully you guys, if you want to see or watch a specific city builder, don't, uh, you know, don't be afraid. Just put it down there in the in the comment section, and I'm gonna head and call. I'm probably gonna cover it because I like playing things that either I haven't seen before, I haven't played before, or actually whatever people ask for, I'll play it. Uh, well, I'll try to play. If you guys ask me for ten games, of course I cannot <laughs> play ten games at the same time, but I'll cover most of them. Uh, one game I have in mind is the Universum. It, uh, it just released a new uh, update. It's called the Moon. I never played that game. That game has been in my wish list since uh, 2019, I believe. And it never played that game. I have watched many, many videos of that game. I don't know. I never played it. Uh, might be. Maybe this week, this upcoming week, uh, maybe we start playing the Universe. Uh, I, I plan to uh, retake Ostrich as well, as well, if you don't you haven't seen that uh, episode or that uh, series make sure you watch it it's a really nice game we're probably gonna be starting a new series uh, since we already learned a lot of stuff and i just want to apply what we learned and you know put it into practice but anyways uh, for a moment there we had a 500 coins and no longer now it keeps going down it's just the upkeep if you look at this it's just the upkeep it's the upkeep who keeps eating us and that's unfortunate. We have a lot of people, and that's probably what's it. Now, the house, do we have to pay upkeep? We do not. Now, we do have to pay 541 for the church. I wonder for the Lord Manor, 118. What about this Lord Manor? 65, 148. So, yeah. It looks like this one right here is eating us alive. What about this 50? And what about the Wooder Keep? 143 each? Or it's just... Okay, just one would keep. Okay, that's fine. Looks like the church might be the the what's eating all the most. Yes, like consuming more uh, for the upkeep the most. All right. Whoa, look at the clothes, guys. Yeah. Okay, so that looks like that weaver hut actually helped quite a lot. Okay, which is good. And I hope I hope that bakery we're we're building helps with the bread as well. So so the cloth is improving. The clothes situation. I'm going to start selling clothes. I think I have it for 100, 150. So, yep, we're good to go there. We should be starting to sell more clothes. As soon as we reach out that uh, we get this bakery, I'm hoping we can get... Ooh, the, <laughs> everything requires tool. I'm desperately needing tools here. So, I'm going to I'm gonna prioritize this one right now. It looks like service has not been a problem right now. I guess they're attending this one. Yeah, quite, you know, a little bit. I'm going to pause the church and I'm going to pause the mark, the the garden. Not the, yeah, the, the garden up back then. And we just need to increase this production. I, I don't know what's happening here, but we got to be fast here, guys. We got to be fast in producing more tools. Yeah, I'm going to pause all of them because we really need the bakery and I need the iron. This is the most important one. We can actually pass this one right now for now. This is the most important one. So once we start producing our own iron, we can start then. We can risk it and buy some tools, but we're going to be so deep into depth 
that are I don't really feel like doing so. There's no penalty of going to dev, I think. But if we put to buy, or actually, I don't think they're gonna buy into negatives. I don't remember. Buy bread. We are going to assist with that, and that money, of course, we don't have bread in storage. That's always the case. I mean, uh, as, I mean, we just need to take a keep an eye on the storage here. As soon as we see five, and I think he's coming with with sixteen here. So, <laughs> make sure. Hopefully, he stores there. Nope, he's taking it right into the market. <laughs> Is that a market gender? I wonder. Uh, transporter, where are you taking it then? Let's see, let's see here. Where are you taking it? Oh, they're taking it right into the market? Nope, right there. Perfect. That's it. Delivered. We have delivered five bread. We could gain 400 coins. I mean, 200 coins. And we're just going down into them again. That's the usual. Let's go ahead and buy some tools. Uh, I don't know if this is gonna be a little bit crazy, but I'm gonna be buy. I'm gonna buy 20 tools. We're gonna see a big red number there once the guy start. You know, comes in here, and of course, you, we have we have a lot of cloth, but that's fine. Better to have almost the the. It's better to have more of the end, the pro, the end product, the final product, rather than the, uh, you know, the prime or the basic product. That makes sense. All right, did we buy any? Looks like we bought some. Yeah, definitely we bought like six or five. It looks like we bought some definitely. Uh, so the money went down into the red, but yeah, they took it right away. So they should be building these. We need five more. Hopefully they're bringing some more. Uh, the next trade route, bring some more. Bread is, is down again. Keeps going up and down, that's fine. How's the bakery going? Uh, looks like our bakery. I mean, it's almost ready to go. Uh, all the, the the resources, the materials have been delivered. Or just, all they need to do is hit it with the hammer. Yeah, I appreciate everybody, you know, supporting the channel. I really do. It's been a great journey. It's been an amazing. Sometimes it takes time for me to plan ahead of what we're gonna do. But I think I think we're gonna be doing great uh, this year. I'm hoping. 2022 is going to bring us a little... Uh, there's a lot of city builders that are going to be covering. So, foundation right now is going to be our main game because, I mean, who doesn't like a good foundation, right? <laughs> but yeah, but definitely we're going to be covering... Hopefully, once I had more, I have more time in the future, which is going to happen soon, I uh, can cover at least two videos a day. And that's what I want to do. One in the... Uh, one, uh, like, one in the morning, U.S. time, like, U.S. the... Uh, East Coast time and one at night, US East Coast time. Like two, uh, two games, you know, two different games, two different series. That way we can progress even faster. How we? How is the army doing? The army doing okay. They're just healing. That uh, garden is gonna help us heal. I'm just not gonna send the military mission. And unfortunately, we're not we're not promoting anyone unless we can promote uh, soldiers. We cannot yet. So, yeah. Enough promotion for now. We're not gonna promote anyone in a very while. I think I think at least at least until we we can recover from the food, which by the way it looks doesn't you know seems like we're gonna it's gonna be fast. It's gonna take us a little bit. Looks like iron ore is being produced. All we need to do really is this one right here. Rather, we gotta unpause that builder, and uh, yeah, we have fourteen tools now because we keep buying them. But I think, I think once we, here's the deal. I don't know if it's, I read something about, uh, about this in Reddit. I don't know if it was, if it was a bug or something, but there was a person there complaining that the iron smelter was not producing, uh, iron fast enough, or it was complaining that it didn't have any uh, materials or was complaining like in, not enough, uh, rough material, raw materials or something like that. Something up regarding the iron smelter not producing either not producing enough or not producing iron at all so i don't know if that's what's happening right now that i mean we do have iron right we do have uh yeah we have 108 iron and uh, you know they should be producing more iron i would expect or maybe we have it's a two it's a ratio of two iris melter per one blacksmith that that could be true too so that's why we're building a second one here 
right? We can actually build a third one if we want to, and we go bananas there, you know? And that might not be a bad idea either. Once we start producing enough tools, we can start selling them. And that's actually going to help us a lot. Because right now, we're all our builders are stopped because of tools, right? We should be able to produce them. I mean, remember, we are, we are actually... I think we're going to need a third. Because we're actually using Iron Force Swords as well. So I'm going to I'm gonna place a third one. You guys probably are screaming like, what is Gold Coin doing? He's just, he's just going crazy about building a bunch of things this episode, right? <laughs> There's a bunch of things that we've been building. Uh, how many buildings have we placed? One run right there. <laughs> well, the church and that one was already there. The uh, Another iron smelter here. A bakery. Yeah. Well, I mean, if we are building, it means that we are improving. Like, we are going better. We're growing. So, let's go ahead and, like, assign the two miners here. That's going to help us, too, with gems and jewelry. It looks like we sold two of them, actually. Ooh, 125 marble. Wow. That rich capacity there. Ooh, look at that. Oh, wait a minute. Is that finished? It is not yet, right? No, it's not. Okay, wow. That's amazing. I thought I paused this. <laughs> I guess it wasn't paused. Now, is it improving? No, still not improving desirability yet. Oh, wow. It's looking great. Uh, it's random play, randomly placed. Doesn't make any sense to place it there. I just wanted to see it, right? Now, let's see. I saw. I noticed that uh, those buildings require some conditions. Do, do, does that one require conditions? Uh, let's see. Is there any condition with that? We'll see it here. Oh, it's just a one-time building, I guess. What is this one? Uh, oh, yeah, the masterpiece. So the building's a standalone building. Okay. So we can actually place one of these. Kind of like here, right? Outside territory. Of course, this is going to take uh, a lot of marble and uh, outside territory. It's going to... Uh, Take a look at our territory. Ooh, ideally we'll be placed here, right? Something like that. We can actually place it here and let's see what we can put on top of it. Oh, okay. We can like, oh, cool, cool. What is this? What can I place on top of it? Okay, I see. But does it have water? Looks like it doesn't. So what if we, can we place this? Nope. Oh, that's cool. So can we place another one? Oh. We can increase it. Oh, that's amazing. It is not taking that much, though, for now. <laughs> Until we place some, some little statues there. Yeah, but it's not taking much. Uh, you can put... Oh, that's nice. And what, what's, what's the benefit of having one of these? Move it. What's the benefit of having one of these? What is it right here? Maintenance cost is decreased by 50%. All parts are by the riverside. Oh, okay. So we have to place it by the riverside. Okay. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> we don't have any river. <laughs> we have a sea, right? Uh, ooh. All parts must be placed by the riverside. But now, it only says that this building... Uh, optional effect. And what is the general effect, though? Where uh, the the build this building's main cost is decreased by fifty, so there is no very good effects. Just this building's maintenance cost is decreased by fifty if we build it next to the riverside. So we probably don't want to build it right now. It doesn't bring us any good to the home to the oh look at the berries. Speaking of berries, do we want to <laughs> we want to build another thing and put it here? <laughs> we probably actually do for just selling berries. Uh, the berries are going actually up. Remember what, those times where we're suffering because of berries? Not anymore. Right, so these guys can go all the way down here and start grabbing uh, tools. If I mean, uh, iron if they need. Right? I think, did we unpause? Let's unpause this one right here and unpause this one. I think we're going to start. We're starting to get the tools that we need. Because, of, you know, we're buying it basically. Both were selling good. Planks were selling good. Wood is amazing. I'm thinking of putting another charcoal burner actually here. And that's going to be a really nice idea. So let's go ahead and burner. 
charcoal. Charcoal's hot, if that's what's the that is called. Uh, let's place it around here, actually. I don't want to put more stuff here towards the... We're going to be killing the, the, the animals with all the contamination, right? Let's place it right there. It costs 100 coins. It'll calm down. It'll happen. Let's just keep it open here. All right, I think, I mean, we talked a lot. Okay, we just, oh, look at that. Do you see that? We bought we bought 20 tools. We went into depth, and the tools were removed immediately. Where are they going, though? Oh, they're there, but they're already... Why are they not being marked as in storage, though? They're probably, like, already called for, like, reserve. Look at that. They're taking tools like crazy. It's like, wow. It's like a, a war for water instead of being of water. The war is uh, is made because of uh, it's happening because of tools. Yeah. All right, there you go. <laughs> we gotta we gotta keep an eye always all the time when situations are like this. So we have immigration open. Let's let's you know let's wait until we have six or seven. It's always ha always good to have uh, some people uh, on a on unemployed available for when they need. Let's see, we have a monk requesting an audience here. They're requiring wood. I mean, we have plenty of those. I can give it to you right away. And with that, guys, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. I will see you in the next episode. I will see you next time. And I will see you very, very soon. Bye-bye.